Well, have a guess where I am today. I'll, sh I'll mix up a few clips so that you can uh, get the idea of where I am and see if you can guess where I am. I'm on my own today, as you can probably see. No Ellie, no dogs even. Ellie's gone out for brunch with uh, Charlotte and Catherine, our two daughters. So hopefully she's having a nice time. I'm trying to find a bacon roll. I found a coffee shop, but I'm going over there in a minute to see if they do bacon rolls. So I just wanted to say about the, um, the hat thing. A lot of you commented on um, my hat in the last video that we did. Now here's a conundrum I could do with some help with. What is wrong with my head? Every time I wear this hat, I have the torch right in the centre above my nose and I've only got to walk for 10 minutes and it's twisted round like that. <laughs> I don't know why. I must have a funny shaped head. Let me know what you think, preferably without being abusive. There were some amazing suggestions of what was causing it. Uh, some people said my head was too big. Some people said my head was too small. Some people said that um, the reason that the, uh, the hat was spinning round was because of my eyebrows, that I was moving my eyebrows. So I've tried to emulate that, but it doesn't seem to work. Yeah, some people said that uh, theirs doesn't do that. Some people said it does. So it's quite a mixture, really. But the, the best suggestion was, and thanks very much, Carlos, that, um, that I super glue it to my head. I think he also suggested I, I could use um, Velcro, which was nice of him wouldn't be quite so painful. So thanks for that. Another suggestion was um, I could use Gorilla Glue and the best of all, staple it to my head. I've been called Mr Potato Head and Flat Head. So I've taken quite a lot of abuse really. And of course some people just laughed. Uh, and one suggestion was that um, I had a bit of a sweaty forehead don't think so. It was January. I was freezing cold, actually. But uh, yeah, good ideas. Thanks very much. But the best suggestion of all is how to stop it happening. I'll demonstrate. Take the torch out and hook it over my nose. And I walk around like that all day. I suppose it would stop it twisting left and right. I wonder how long it'd be before I got arrested. So have you guessed where I am yet? Actually, it's my first time here, but uh, I want to come back with Ellie. I know Ellie will like it here. Well, just a couple more clues to go now. This is what's called the Antarctic 100 Memorial. This depicts the faces of Scott and the four companions who died with him. This clip is looking out from a very iconic building. I suspect this clip has definitely given the game away as to where I am. If you haven't got it yet, I will add the answer at the end of the video. Well, you can see in that building behind me, that's the Welsh Senate. Well, I'm going to go and get myself a cup of coffee. GoPro, stop recording. GoPro, stop recording. GoPro, stop recording. While I've talked about my tribulations, I hope you've enjoyed having a, a brief look around this place. Now I'm going to go and meet Ellie. We've got an Easter message to do. Mmm, nice. Hello. Hello to you all. <laughs> it's nice for me to be back with you. I hope that Graham looked after you in my absence. I suspect it was quite fun just having him all to I yourselves. I gave him a guided tour around the place. Did you? Yeah. Do you think they worked out where you were? Um, well, I haven't told them no. where I was, but there were some pictures towards the end where, if they didn't get it from that, 
or they don't deserve to get it. <laughs> brutal, yeah. absolutely brutal. Well, I hope he looked after you. I had a very nice time, didn't I? Yeah. I went to brunch with um, our two daughters. Probably the last chance I'll get to go out with them before um, our eldest has her baby and the baby's due in about four weeks time so we're getting very excited about that aren't we yeah it could happen any time now yeah it? it could be yes yes it could happen at any time right first of all i just wanted to thank everybody um we had a, we hit a couple of milestones just a few days ago the first one was um half a million views five hundred thousand mm. views uh just unbelievable really so uh, thank you all for that. Yeah, thank and, you. And that was really good. And then just a couple of days later, we hit the second milestone of um, 4,000 subscribers. Mm. So we were very pleased about that as well. Yeah, and we couldn't have done it without you, could we? No, so, we couldn't. It's no. taken a long time for us to get, to get there, but uh, we're not in a rush. We like what we do, so we'll carry on doing it as we do it. Yeah, and what we have found is that we really love our subscribers as well. Mm, you know, you, ones, yeah, you hear of so many, I wouldn't say horror stories, but cases where people end up with some quite nasty comments and people who don't particularly like, you know, they just like to cause trouble. We've had very little of that. I think we're very, very lucky. The subscribers we have are amazing and it's because of their support through watching the channel and also through the Facebook page that it actually keeps us motivated to keep going because yeah. it's yeah. hard work. I mean, it can take two, two and a half days a week to edit a vlog, which comes out once a week, can't yeah. it? Yeah. And sometimes you think, oh, you know, it's hard. So thank you. Keep them coming. Keep the comments coming. If you haven't subscribed, please do. And yeah, just keep doing what you're doing. Yeah. It, you know, unless you want us to stop. <laughs> well, they just don't tune in if they want us to stop. Oh. We don't have to stop. <laughs> they just well, we have can to still stop. inflict them with more vlogs. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's not going to go away. <laughs> um, oh. But if you feel like joining the Facebook group, please do. Mm. Um, we. I think we have quite a lot of fun on there, don't we? We do, we do. Um, it's not van dependent either, is it? No, no, no. We've got people on there who haven't got... Uh, haven't even got a tent. Mm. Um, people who just go hiking, and we've got people all around the world, mm. haven't we? Australia, New Zealand, yeah. America, Canada, mm. Germany. For example, last night there were some quite interesting messages going backwards and forwards. Basically, people were giving me abuse he loves because it. of my hat. It's a very light-hearted Facebook group where anything goes except for politics and, uh, and too many arguments we don't really like that sort of thing do we on no. there but jokes and pictures of your pets and all sorts of things even if you're an armchair camper you know you just like watching other people going out in vans and things it's still it still be fun i think we we are very tolerant we must be very tolerant we put because, up with each uh, other <laughs> uh, yeah but more to the point, we put up with Ricky Matthews, don't well, we? Well, true. Oh, yeah. We put up with Ricky Matthews on... Now, what is his channel called? Rick he's... and Heather. Mm. At the moment, it's Rick and Heather, Pearl the CV20. Yes. But very soon, it's going to be Rick and Heather and something else. Yeah, the mystery, which is coming out on Tuesday. Uh, Monday. Monday? Mm. So the day after you've seen this, tune in to their channel because you'll find out what their new van's going to be. I think that's right, the 10th, yeah. Yeah, I think that's right. Yeah. Bank holiday Monday. Good Friday today. Mm. Anyway, we <laughs> hope you have a, a great Easter. Um, we're recording this actually on Good Friday, That's aren't we? That's right, but it'll but, be seen um, on Easter on Sunday. Easter Sunday, yeah. yeah. So don't eat too many chocolate eggs. I'm not going to be able to because I'm only going to get one. But um, <laughs> what can I do? Well. Oh, by the way, we've got hot cross buns here and yeah. I've been sworn not to eat them yet. I'm not allowed to eat them on camera. <laughs> Well, he gets crumbs all round his face and raisins in his teeth. <laughs> oh, dear. You can have one if you really want, darling. I made you that. Yes. Got, I'm going to show them. Let me show them. Look what I made for Graham. Look. Look at this. It's the wrong colour hat. It is. But look. Just look at that. He even got a little torch on the, on yeah. the hat. Yeah. And guess how I kept the hat on the head? On his head. Blue tape? No. Sticky pads? Yeah, glued it on. Oh, right. Which is what we should do to your hat. <laughs> we need to glue it on. That's cute. I'll get less trouble out of this one than I do out of that one, I can tell you. So there we go. Happy Easter, darling. Mm. 
That is a hard-boiled egg, isn't it? It is. So I'll be able to eat that later. You can. Yeah. It's good. called Egbert. Oh, oh, you've named the bugger. Yeah, Egbert. See his oh, little, little suit he's wearing? Can't eat him if he's been named, can I? Egbert. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, Egbert. Well, we're going to end this vlog here. So we wish you all a very happy Easter. Yeah, whatever you're doing, whether you're just relaxing, whether you're with family, whether you're away in vans, tents, caravans, hotels, whatever you're doing, have a fantastic Easter. And we'll be back with you on Friday. Yes. With the Forest of Dean continuing. Yep, Sculpture Part 2. Sculpture Trail Part 2. Part, yeah. part 2, so we'll catch you then. Take care. Bye. GoPro, stop recording. <laughs> GoPro, stop recording. GoPro, stop recording. He obviously wants us to keep recording. GoPro, stop recording. GoPro, stop recording. <laughs> well, I hope you GoPro, record. stop recording. I think the damn thing's gone rogue. That blooming voice control is more trouble than it's worth. How do you think I feel? That's how you control me with your voice control. <laughs>